Hi, I'm King Faisal, and you're watching Trailers from Hell. We're going to look at the trailer for a wonderful movie, Graham Greene's, or Carol Reed's, depending on your auteur theory, of uh, Our Man in Havana, starring Alec Guinness. Terrific picture. My wife, uh, Deborah, Professor Landis, was recently invited to teach at the National Film School, which is about an hour outside of Havana. So about two months ago, I went with her to Cuba. And while there, I went on Amazon.com and bought every movie about Cuba and Havana. And I've come to the conclusion the best two are Godfather 2, which was shot in the Dominican Republic, which is really kind of like Cuba. It really, the fall of Batista in that is wonderful. And the scene where they're cutting up the cake and cutting up the country, very accurate. And this film, Carol Reed's Our Man in Havana. This is Alec Guinness doing a little intro to the film this is one of those things they shoot for the trailer. The great Noel Coward recruits Alec Guinness, a vacuum cleaner salesman in Cuba, to become a secret agent and spy for the British. Uh, basically, it's one of those movies where he's pretending to do one thing, everyone thinks it's real, all the other espionage agencies get involved, but actually it's about a man and his daughter there's a lovely shot of Havana. It looks just like this, only with no cars and falling apart. Um, this is a truly funny and smart picture with a great performance from the great Ernie Kovacs, who's really good in this film. And I'm still surprised they allowed them to shoot in Havana. Did you know Batista actually visited the set? Because it's highly critical of his regime. There's Ernie Kovacs turning around and looking at Maureen O'Hara who's beautiful and sexy and wonderful in this picture. It's a smart movie about a father who will do anything to get his daughter away from this sleazy guy. Noel Coward, who looks elegant under any circumstances, plays his lieutenant. That's Ralph Richardson, the head of the Secret Service. Joe Morrow, his Americanized daughter. Burl Ives plays a German doctor with a past or not who is a secret agent or not. This is a picture in which innocent people get murdered. I guess you could call it a black comedy if it wasn't so accurate. But it's very, very entertaining and a real glimpse of a lost time when gangsters and John Foster Dulles ran Cuba. And uh, you go to Cuba now and you can still get a good rum drink. But that's about it. That and cigars is what they have. It's, uh, it's a tragic place. And everyone's waiting for the Castros to die. Two famous stars of two continents. Look at that. A world-famous bestseller. Graham Greene wrote the script. Of course, it's wonderful. Alec Guinness, way before Smiley, is wonderful. It's a smart, intelligent, well-photographed film. And if you remember, this is the same director as The Third Man. The same director as Oliver. Great director, great film.